Hey guys, it's Windows Up, and I'm going to show you how to censor out cursing and whatnot in Audacity. So, unfortunately, I don't know how to record audio off my computer, so I'm going to have to give you a demonstration of what I'm talking about uh, here. So, uh, here we go. <coughs> <coughs> You are a son of a Okay, you get it? That's what I'm going to show you how to do. So, uh, let's do this. So if you want to censor out cursing or whatever you want to in videos, you need three programs. One, you need Rad Video Tools. Two, you need Audacity. Three, you need Windows Movie Maker. Okay, so, uh, First thing you need to do is open up a video, uh, get a video onto your desktop or wherever you put your videos. I have my video right here, it's called video.mp4. So what you want to do now is open up Rad Video Tools. <coughs> okay, so now you need to um, find your video. I prefer just searching for it down here. So here we go. And see, it's right here. So now I'm gonna click it and press convert a file. Now this window should have popped up. So now you have to make sure that convert video is not checked. You have to make sure this is not checked. You have to make sure convert audio is checked. And then you press convert. And as you can see, it was done in just one second or so. So I'm going to click done. So now you have your audio on your desktop or wherever you put your videos. But we're not going to leave yet. We're going to go to convert a file again. But this time, make sure convert video is checked. Make sure this is not checked. Make sure convert, convert audio is not checked uncheck it and then press convert now this little window should have popped up so now what you want to do is press this arrow right here and then go to uh, click right here where it says divx 6.8.4 codec one logical if your computer doesn't have this option go to xvid mpeg4 codec but since my computer has this option I'm going to click that and I'll press ok So it shouldn't take very long because this is a very short video. So we're just going to wait a few seconds. Okay, so as you can see it's done. But your video might be a little longer so it might not take be that short. So I'm going to click done. And I'm going to, so now we can get out. Right view tool, so X that out. So now your uh, vi video and audio should be here. They should be done. So now I'm going to put the video aside because we don't need that right now. Okay, so after you're done with that, let's open up Audacity. Don't mind that, it's something I've ever done before. Okay, so anyway, now you want to go to File. Then press Open. And search for your audio file, search for your WAV file. And mine's right here. Video. Oh, whoops. I mean, right here. Video.wave. So I'm going to click that and press open. Okay, so, uh... Now what you want to do is, uh, search for the part you want censored. All you do is click play and find the part you want censored, but you won't be able to hear if I click play, so I'm just going to select one random part. So, you click and drag where you want it censored. I'm just going to say it's here. Okay, so, 
Now let's go to generate and click tone. Now this little window should have popped up. What you want for waveform is sine. That's the same. But for frequency, you need to take this out if it's there and set it to 875.50 Am Amplitude uh, 1.00 And length in seconds you don't touch um, If you touch that then the time will be all messed up and it won't link It won't be in tune with your video so Let's just say that's default. That'll always be what it says. You just leave that. So after you're done with that, you click Generate Tone. And now as you can see, it's just like a bar. So, now what you want to do is go to File. And then you go to export as wave. And you can save it as whatever you want. So uh, now we're just going to skip on to Windows Movie Maker where I show you how you can bind your uh, video new audio. So uh, let's go do this. Now the Windows Movie Maker part shouldn't take very long at all. All you have to do is drag your video and audio to the imported media folder. And then you need to drag your video and drop it in the video spot. And then you drag your edit audio to audio slash music. And then it'll appear right here. As you can see right here, uh, that's where we put the censored spot. So, that's basically it right there. So now you need to go to File, Publish Movie. You just click Next. You can, and when it gets to here, you just call whatever you want. And you click Next. And when it comes here, you should just click Best Quality for Playback on my computer. This is the settings for your movie. And then you click publish. So that's how you get. Uh, that's how you um censor out cursing and whatnot with these two programs. Uh, thank you for watching my tutorial, and I hope it helped. Uh, thank you.